Bibi na tuambia kwa mba huu nuanzi Alikuwa meta ame parana machali kata Juggling things can be a bit hard. And that's just the truth. Sometimes it's hard to balance. I have never felt this in love with myself. I have never believed in myself this much. I know you, yeah, know that you're in your room putting makeup on. You know me, yeah, know about all my dreams and where I went wrong. I stress way too much about what I want, cause it's not here yet. You talk in your sleep. Almost heavenly Who in you said Guys, I'll have to look for another day to come for my nail appointment because wamefunga. Hi guys, today is Monday, Easter Monday, and I am headed to church. <sighs> wow, um <laughs> I don't remember the last time I went to church and I've been looking for a church but not physically. But this year I really wanna look for a church physically. I don't want to just look for churches or online and be like, oh you know, kapos, a visit when so last week one of my gospel musicians said anafanya live recording yeah his album is called ibada kita so i was like yeah okay i've always wanted to see this guy live so why not go to this church and if the vibe there you know syncs with my vibe then maybe that would be my church so that's where i'm going hmm. i really don't want to not go today aki guy aki god aki god in voice my many and oh he said, ask and you shall receive, guys. Rainy me, shall we turn it Even when you're not around, I feel you, boy. 
What's crazy is it's April 11th and I haven't been to the gym once. London, Amanda. <sighs> and it's not even a matter of not being disciplined or falling out of it or not me loving it anymore. It's just sometimes you fall out of balance. Sometimes life is like, I don't know, I don't know how to explain it. Like juggling things can be a bit hard. And that's just the truth. Sometimes it's hard to balance. Hey guys, so I wanted to show you guys my hair. This is how it looks like. This is how it looks like. I love it. I love it. I actually do love it. And I love the color. Like, this is so out of my comfort zone, you guys. Like, maybe I black braids. If I go too much, maybe I put the, the frilly things. Sorry, boho. Boho. <laughs> but bold color like this one number 30 braids and then the work was you must think or must think mm -mm. <laughs> very out of my comfort zone anyway i wanted to talk about something and from the gym and i was coming back i was looking at the jacaranda trees side was in a zikona tule tumbe gutuna kongi to round and then soon they're going to like become the purple flowers um sorry sorry about that so yeah 
I was looking at the jacaranda trees and how say it's just the kambegu and then now after a while it's gonna flower into it's gonna flower to become purple it's so beautiful and then after that it's gonna yote itashia diambu kitchen and then the streets are gonna be lined up in purple flowers and I just it just it, it didn't hit me because this has always been a fact but it just reminded me of how seasonal life is because sometimes you're going through a lot and you think this is the end sometimes it's not gonna get better but then just give it a few go to time kidu go to time because everything is seasonal you're going to get out of there and you're going to get into a new season and then the new season is probably gonna be beautiful it's not probably gonna be the season for you to bloom maybe right now is the season, is the season for you to you know grow for you to develop for you to create something which you're gonna reap in this other season so i think whatever it is whatever season you're in right now i think it's it's very very important to like take note of this to just even even knowing that you're actually in this kind of season is very impactful because when you know whatever season you're in then it's gonna help you prepare for the next season and you're gonna carry the lessons that you learned in this season to the next season you know like for me right now i'm in the season of isolation yeah and i just i feel like i have really fallen in love with myself like when i realized oh wow but then to tell you in actually the season of you know isolation because i don't really socialize a lot with friends at this time for some reason like everyone's just busy you know so i once i realized hey yeah this is what's happening everyone's just busy and even when you call you know sometimes una fikiria like it's people ignoring you but no like everyone's just busy everyone's just like taking care of their own issues you know so we're in a season of isolation so i just decided you know i'm just gonna develop me i'm just gonna grow me that's why you see me going to the gym i'm eating healthy i'm getting more in tune with my spirituality i'm learning more about my god i'm creating a relationship with my god and i think when you realize the season you're at it's very impactful for the next season that you're gonna be because you're gonna carry all those lessons and you're gonna grow as a human being for example i am i don't know how to say it. like I, i'm so excited by the way for this journey i feel i just i have never felt this in love with myself i have never believed in myself this much like things might not be going a hundred percent how i want them to go but i for sure for sure for sure for sure for sure know that god's got me and i got me you know like i Maybe you should do more of these sit down talk videos. But anyway, thank you so much for watching my video if you watched up to here and you have not subscribed. Do subscribe. Please subscribe. Um and like this video because it really helps my engagement. It helps my goal algorithm. <laughs> I'm gonna see you in the next one. Bye.